what's up y'all welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if this is your first time here this video we're going to be installing a wig from Unis. all the information for this hair of course will be in the description box below so just a little quick unboxing the first thing that came in the box is this wig cap and then this pack here that includes a wig cap some lashes and a wig band and they also send a dust bag so this is the wig here this is a four inch pre-plucked pre-bleached and they already do the baby hairs for you as you can see this wig is knotless so you can go really close up and you don't see any knots and this is just the look without the white paper behind it they already cut that lace for you so it's super wide like you can see here so it covers pretty far um, you have your two combs at the sides you have your elastic band at the back that's adjustable as well as this comb and this silicone film around the outside of the wig to keep it from slipping and sliding and on top of that this is their um, breathable wig right here so it doesn't get hot on your head this hair is super super shiny and thick um, I'm gonna have the density on the screen for you but let's go ahead and get into the video so I already have my wig cap on and I just want to show you guys really quickly how fast it is to actually install this wig. So mind you, I just have on a regular wig cap and I did absolutely nothing to this wig. This is the wig fresh out of the box. I'm just adjusting the combs around the wig to make it fit comfortably on my head and adjusting the wig band. And this is what the wig looks like. So if you want to slide the wig on your head like this and wear it like this, you absolutely can. Like the way they have the baby hairs and everything is already really cute and it's also really sturdy so you can wear this wig gluelessly you don't need any glue and you can't see any knots so for this to be jet black hair and you don't see any knots it's really great and it's really thick and full um, but for me on this install I'm actually going to color the wig cap that I'm using and this is cream makeup um, from Ruby Kisses I got this from Amazon so I'm just going to color the wig cap really quickly and then put the wig back on my head Okay, so once the wig is on right, I'm going to have to do some adjustments because as you can see, my hairline on the sides come out pretty far further than where the wig stops. So what I'm going to do is um, extend the baby hairs on the wigs um, to make it a little bit longer to cover up where my natural hair shows on the sides. And that's just because my hairline just is a little funky <laughs> you know not everybody's hairline is like mine so you may not have to do this honestly but I did I just and honestly I didn't have to do that like I could have wore the wig down and it would have been fine but I just like to do this because I feel like it makes it look better So after I've cut and curled my edges, I'm just using my Eco Gel to swoop the remaining part of my baby hairs into place, covering up um, my natural hair that's left out. Um, now the baby hairs that I made were a little bit long, so I did wind up having to cut them a little bit more just to make them shorter, um, just to get them to be styled how I like it.
All right, so now I'm just gonna wrap my edges and let them sit. And while they're doing that, I'm going to um, wand curl my hair with my wand curler that I got from Amazon. I think this is like a one and a half inch um, barrel. It's pretty wide. I'll link the um, hot tools that I got from Amazon down below, but I really love this wand curler. Um, but this hair is really, really thick and silky. Um, so I was really excited to curl it just to see what it looks like. So I'm just parting my hair into smaller sections, like one inch sections and curling away from my face. So now I'm just using my got to be free spray and I'm just spraying um, where my baby hairs are in the corners and I'm also following behind it with my wax stick. Um, I do this to prep because I'm going to be um, hot combing these areas here. I just feel like it makes the style look more better like it helps so that you can see my baby hairs more so I'm like essentially pushing up the hairline, pushing back the hairline a little bit. And then I'm also using my hot comb to flatten the top of the wig so that you can see my part more. So since I'm wearing a middle part, I'm just gonna cut some layers in the front of the wig to define my face. I like to part the wig in the front um, vertically and then use my scissors to cut the hair going away from my face. And I just do this in layers, just depending on how many layers I want to frame my face. But I'll just like part my hair multiple times and just cut until I think it looks good. Lastly, I'm just gonna take my cream makeup again and my flat top brush, and I'm gonna put it along the front of the hairline just to make the lace um, blend better with my natural complexion, um, just because it looked a little bit white at the front. Um, and yeah, that's definitely not the color of my scalp. So I'm just coloring it in just a little bit. And that is it for this install, y'all. This is super, super simple and really easy. Um, I really love this hair. This hair is really amazing. It's really soft, it's really silky, and it's really thick and fluffy and bouncy. And of course, I love that this is a glueless install, so it's super simple. I really love that these knots are pre-bleached and it's also pre-plucked. So the hairline looks very, very natural. I really didn't have to do anything to it at all. They did all of the work. The only thing that you have to do is literally put it on and style it to your liking. So that is exactly what we need for people on the go because don't nobody have time to be fooling with hair for hours on end. But anyways, you guys, all the information for this hair will be in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching this video, y'all. Uh, that's it. Adios. Till next time.